Okay, come on now, everybody. Um, 08 98 double three double five seven eight. Meanwhile, Quentin Wilson has advice about used Range Rovers on 08 98 double three double five seven nine. The story of motor racing, the power and the glory continues at 9.30 tonight with a look back to the heyday of the road races, the ever faster and dangerous sport which was banned in the 1950s. The power and the glory at 9.30 on two. Back by public demand, the best of this summer's live Radio 1 concerts with the world's greatest rock and pop acts. Tonight, the Pet Shop Boys and Gloria Estefan. Tomorrow, The Stranglers, OMD and Rod Stewart. And on Sunday, Simple Minds. The sounds of this summer's greatest live gigs, backed by public demand. This weekend on BBC Radio 1, 97 to 99 FM. Friday on 2. Public Eye investigates the plight of thousands of children who leave council care each year and asks, will the new Children Act provide a solution? Richard Maybe traces the development of the wild garden. Its appeal was as a way of enclosing or capturing nature, of enjoying its delight without surrendering control. Monsieur Le Maire unveils his magnificent edifice. Brilliant idea of yours. A small breakthrough in public hygiene and a great leap forward for Clochmel. The power and the glory celebrates the golden age of the road racers and the excitement and drama of hill racing. Tony Slattery offers a little topical satire. Do we get an extra point for pointing out that Saddam Hussein was once a member of village people? No, you don't. <laughs> and Richard O'Brien welcomes you aboard the mystery train. There's a flying satellite and a 30-foot giant a few miles out on 66. A 30-foot giant? Friday on 2. Now, with a spaceship heading out of control towards the sun, it's a task for international rescue in Thunderbirds. Five, four, three, two, one. Thunderbirds are go.